The health of oceans is a critical issue for our planet, an issue that we feel closely connected to at MERSC. Our first obligation is of course to minimize any negative impacts through our operations, avoiding spills and effectively managing waste. But we also want to do more than that. We want to give a positive contribution to the ocean health. We do this by supporting ocean science, for example, with weather stations on all our vessels providing observations at sea. And we do this through our support to the ocean cleanup, removing plastic waste from the world's oceans and major rivers. But perhaps the biggest contribution we can make to ocean health is by decarbonizing shipping. Global supply chains are the backbone of the world economy. They enable business to source, produce and sell in an effective manner and they enable people to achieve a higher living standard. Shipping is an effective way of transporting large quantities, but it is a hard to abate sector, and we need firm commitment and actions now. We are convinced that it is possible to decarbonize shipping. We are committed to reaching net zero CO2 emissions by 2050, and we will have the first carbon neutral container vessel under water already by 2023. We have a unique opportunity to create a fast and tangible impact to society in the area of decarbonization. Fortunately, we as MERS are not on this journey alone. We are engaging with leading organizations and seeing a strong commitment from our customers. But we also need ambitious policy frameworks in place, focusing on well-to-wake emissions. We are confident that in partnership with our industry, customers, policymakers and the global community, we can make a real impact in support of ocean health and sustainable development. Thank you.